Hi, friends. Thanks for joining us for today's devotion. You know, uh, the other day, my son Daniel asked me, Dad, do you think this year will make it into the history books? And I thought, that's a pretty good thought. I bet it will. Um, for difficult reasons, a pandemic and uh, the rioting, the social unrest, the, the divisiveness in our country right now. Pastor Pete shared some uh, Barna research with me recently that was really interesting. One of the things I think that might make it into the history books is how we're worshiping, how we're connecting to church. According to Barna, there are three groups during this COVID-19 world. One, people who have continued to engage with church by watching their home congregation. Two, people who've started watching online services of another church. And three, people who are not watching anything online. And one big thing to note is this, according to Barna, the younger people are, the more likely it is that they have stopped attending church during the pandemic. Contrast that with this. People who've stopped attending church online during this time report higher levels of anxiety and stress. Isn't that interesting? While those who are staying in church either online or in person report having a higher level of security. It reminds me of Psalm 94, 18 and 19. When I said my foot is slipping, your love, O oh Lord, supported me. When anxiety was great within me, your consolation brought joy to my soul. So I'm so glad you're tuning into this devotion and I pray that for your sake, the sake of your children, you will stay connected to God through the worship of your congregation, our congregation. Let's pray. This is a prayer from our Lutheran service book, uh, for the nation. Almighty God, you have given us this good land as our heritage. Grant that we remember your generosity and constantly do your will. Bless our land with honest industry, truthful education, and an honorable way of life. Save us from violence, discord, confusion, from pride and arrogance, and from every evil course of action. Grant that we who came from many nations may with many different languages become a united people. And we pray this in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Thanks for joining us, friends, and rest well tonight.